side of the sky tree right now. And we have come to the, what is it called? The World, the World Beer Museum. It's like a restaurant that sells 100 types of beer. And we have come here for lunch because they have the most delicious menu of foods from all over the world. So if you're in Japan and you feel like eating some German food or some Czech food, Italian food, they have it all here. So it's a really cool place to come. Let me show you the menu. All right, so here's some of the beers they have. But if you go to this page, you can see every single kind of beer they have, which is 100 different kinds, and they divide it up between all the different countries. So Czech, America, United Kingdom, Belgium, all the beer you could dream of. It's gonna be pretty hard to choose one. I have to go back to work later, so I won't be drinking, but Kelsey will be. <laughs> it's my day off. <laughs> And yeah, they also have an amazing menu. Everything looks so good. German foods, some type of Czech pancake, which looks really yummy. Czech potato pancake. Meats, pickled cabbage. Oh my God, they have pickles. If these are like regular pickles that aren't sweet, I would be so happy because all the pickles in Japan are sweet and gross. Cheese! But yeah, basically they have lots of different yummy things. Sausages. Wait till you see the desserts. I have to show you guys the desserts page. I don't know if we're gonna have room for this, but check out that honey toast. It's like a whole loaf of bread filled with ice cream and chocolate sauce and fruits. That looks so good. And Kelsey told me the creme brulee is really delicious. Okay, so now it's time to choose food. The hard part. <laughs> Have you decided? No. <laughs> okay, I decided on this curry sausage from Germany. Apparently it is a traditional German dish. It just looks delicious. And what are you getting, Kelsey? Okay, I'm going to invent my own meal. I'm getting this sauerkraut right here. And I'll be getting, let's see, where is it? I'll be getting this double cheeseburger and I'm going to put the sauerkraut on the cheeseburger and it's going to taste amazing. Yeah, it definitely is. <laughs> I can agree with you there. <laughs> okay, so we asked them what their Osusume beer, which one they recommended to us was, and they said this one here, the St. Louis Premium Crike. I guess you call it, which is a very fruity beer. So we are going to try it. Kelsey tried it and she said it tastes like juice. So what I get That is so good. It tastes like raspberry juice. And it smells like super raspberry. It's really good. I can taste cherry and raspberry a lot. It says there's peach in there, but I don't really taste peach. Oh, that's delicious. So this is the best sauerkraut that me and Kelsey have ever had in our entire lives. It is so good. I didn't expect to have it in Japan. And look at how big her burger is. I don't know how you're gonna eat that. How are you gonna eat that, Kelsey? I have no idea, but I can. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> I beat the Lotteria challenge, so. So did I, so did I. Yeah, we have both completed the Lotteria challenge. <laughs> My curry sausages have arrived and they smell super yummy. Like curry, which can be expected. They have like a ketchup sauce on them. Eee! They look really hot, so I'm probably gonna burn myself. <laughs> so good. Oh my god. Wow. Thank you, Germany, for creating awesome food. Thank you, Japan, for making that awesome German food. 
so good. All right, guys, we are done eating. We ate so much. Yes. <laughs> We're so full right now, but that was so yummy. The sauerkraut was amazing. The sausages were amazing. The beer was great. I don't even like beer, but that beer was delicious. <laughs> um, what else did we eat? That was it, because we got really full. We were going to eat the creme brulee, but we didn't have any room left. <laughs> Absolutely no room. But yeah, if you're in uh, Asakusa area, come to the Sky Tree, and this restaurant's located on the seventh floor. Anyone who likes beer, bring them here, because there were so many different kinds of beer that I'm pretty sure you could find almost anything that you want to try. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Bye.